Where are people moving today and why? If you're thinking about moving, there's still plenty of people moving these days. Um, so you may consider some of the inventory and affordability challenges in the housing market and wonder what you can do to help offset those. A new report from Gravy Analytics provides insight into where people are searching for homes and what they're prioritizing most right now. And that information may help you in making your decision. People are moving to cities with lower housing costs. No big surprise there that people are looking to save money. People are re relocating to areas that have less expensive housing options. As a result, sm small cities are thriving. The takeaway for you, if you're having trouble finding a home that fits your budget, it may help to browse other more affordable locations that are nearby. Um, ongoing remote work is another major factor in where people are moving. A recent report from McKinsey Global Institute says this about the recent movement patterns. Many of these moves happen because employees are untethered from their daily commutes, began to care less about how far they live from their home office. If you're a, re a remote or hybrid worker, you don't have to live in the same city or sometimes even the same state as your job. That means you can prioritize other things like being closer to loved ones when buying a home, which may help save with babysitting costs or childcare. In fact, the same McKinney Global Institute report notes for people who moved during the pandemic, 55% reported moving farther from their office. And since remote work is still a popular choice today, home buyers will likely continue to take advantage of that flexibility. So a lot of people are still moving. If you want to help to navigate today's inventory, let's connect and see what the best options are for you and your family.